Williston Middle School teacher Tammy Hunter loves her family's apartment on the Williston State College campus. We got housing here through the school and very reasonable, very reasonable. Her family and is paying hundreds of dollars really less than the going rate for housing uh, thanks to the public-private partnership known as the State Housing Incentive Fund. It has been great, a very positive thing I think for not only ourselves but the residents as well. Um, you know our occupancy is, is high. We're not seeing it slow down. We're continuing to add people to our wait list. Kit Anderson manages this and other complexes where more than half of the units are reserved at a reduced rate for essential service workers. Police, firefighters, teachers, city and county workers and the like. Tammy Hunter's family moved in two years ago from Spokane. My two biggest concerns were my daughter who was a freshman in high school and then housing. Those were my two biggest concerns and uh, both of them turned out great. The program works by providing a dollar-for-dollar dollar state income tax break to private citizens and companies. Their donations, such as the record $5 million donation from XTO Energy last month, help to bring down the cost to private developers who are building housing projects. In return, those developers have to provide a certain number of units at below market rate prices. And that's a key component of keeping things moving the way they need to move. Governor Dalrymple's office hatched the plan and state legislators passed the law to get the housing incentive fund going. And from the governor's view, it's been a success in keeping quality employees in the state who aren't making the big bucks from the economic growth associated with the oil boom that pushed rental rates into the stratosphere. You can't keep up with that pace of growth unless you make it possible for people to stay in their community continue to live there even if they are not making a high salary. We really we really like it. We really like it. Happy you came to North Dakota then? Uh -huh, we love Williston. <laughs> yeah, we really do. And that's the kind of testimonial state officials like to hear. In Williston, Jim Olson, KX News.